Okay, I'm going to demonstrate or try to demonstrate my latest, greatest favorite tool. It's a uh, homemade belt grinder, knife grinder, whatever you want to call it. Um, Multi position uh, belt. Run any kind of belt you want on it. I've got it on a uh, variable speed drive with a three phase motor, and uh, I'll get with it. This is a piece of uh, quarter inch, round uh, piece here. I'm going to just grind a little off the side. No problem. Belt's nice and cool. And these are uh, really high quality belts from, uh, I believe these are 3M or Norton, called the Blaze Orange. I have carved off miles of metal with that one belt. <clears throat> it doesn't clog like a wheel grinder. So I can grind whatever I want to grind on there. If I want to grind aluminum. If I want to grind wood. Whatever I want to grind on there. <clears throat> so if I don't want to grind on there, it's just a simple matter of uh, grabbing a different belt. I'm going to put a uh, leather belt on here that has been uh, saturated with chrome rouge. And it's a real quick deal to change belts. Got a jog button here so I can kind of make sure it's tracking straight. Straight enough. Tighten it up a little bit. The other belts are kind of a funny guy to get tracking. There we go. There we go. I can turn that down real slow with the rouge on there. And just Fine tune this to raise his edge. Got a uh, huge assortment of belts here. Uh, several different uh, wheel attachments. I'll grab the, uh, let's see, a the large wheel. I believe this is a 8 inch wheel. Set in there just like that, and the tool rest and everything work on that as well. We've got small wheel attachment. You can get into little nooks and crannies, and the tool rest will fit on there as well. Rotates around for an even smaller or a different style wheel. And this tool rest is set up so you can put it any way you want it, with several different adapters here, so you can get your uh, rest horizontal, vertical, anyhow, any way you want it. And uh, I just haven't run my stone wheel grinders at all since I've got this thing hooked up. Uh, I think uh, anybody working with metal should have at least one in the shop. And that's it. Thank you.